Hi everybody, and welcome to another adventure with Conquest Bad Fur Day. With me, Aaron. Today we're just going to continue where we left off, and that's defeating the Haybot. We had a week to rest from that little thing. So, let's go and clear out this barn, which I never, ever want to see again in my life. So, let's just go right ahead and climb this little ladder thingy here. And apparently it leads to heaven because it's really, really, really high. So let's just go up. And you want to avoid this boss because I'm winning his you, uh, you fall down. Just like this. Thought I'd demonstrate that for you. Let's just position ourselves. Now if you see here, you can see uh, that's where we collected some of the bees. On top of that little uh, bucket. So let's just go ahead and make our way up. And the game conveniently put a piece of chocolate here in case somebody wanted to demonstrate what would happen if you hit the bee like I did. So let's just go further up. So avoid this little bee right here. Or a wasp. I have no idea what that is. It's it's a bug with a stinger. Let's just call it that. That will be easiest. Now this one here is... Oh, what's the other one? Yeah, it was the other one. Uh, one of these bees is going up and then down. So now we can just make our way up and the bee won't bother us anymore. Here it goes. Now here, you want to keep your finger on the bee button because if we jump, we can see a little bee. And we turn into an anvil and fall down. Because if you don't do that, trust me, you'll die instantly. You'll just be flattened and not get any more alive. Now, if you remember correctly, last time we were way up here, there was water in this thing. But of course, because of the pipes, which the Haybot destroyed, now there isn't. So we'll just make our way towards the door we just opened. And there's a ladder right here, so we just climb on top. Move down to the awesome music. See, there's some water dripping down there. There's no, no water anymore. And our little spot where we want to be is right down here. But we have to be careful not to kill ourselves or hurt ourselves, I don't want to do that. So I'm just going to go around it. And of course the carcass of the rat is still here. And I think... Oh, I'm not sure... Yes, here it is. No way! Let me grab our little tail. We have three tails already. And we can see some cash. Oh yeah, cash. You guys love the cash. Oh, another wise guy. Come on then. Cool. I'm gonna have that gold card before you know it. Yeah, Conquer, keep dreaming, buddy. Okay, so I see another oh, that's the way back, of course. I can see you're dropping money already. So let's go ahead through the tunnel and see where we end up. We end up right here. So it was all for the money. Well, it's pretty much everything we can do here, so let's just head on back. So remember when Conker was here and said, oh, we can go two ways, but there's kind of a pooey smell coming from here? Well, guess what? We're going there! So we're going towards here. And Conker puts on his gas mask because, as you can see, 
this entire place and we're wading through fishies, which is shit. So let's head towards this camp and open the door. Just push. as I have done, most particularly, you will see that there is a gap. And we are not talking any old gap here, my lord. It is a sizable one. Now, milk goes here. What happens? We have the fulcrum here, the milk here. The vet problem, not good. Milk falls off because of a gap. Yeah, that is what is the problem, the gap. I think I see. And the solution. Ah, now this is where it gets complicated. I was mulling over what would fit in the gap. I tried many things. I tried elephants, pot plants, uh, many things. But the one thing, and I was sure of it at the time, I was sure it was a rodent. Sure enough, it was. This one. Various. Which tell us to use the proper vernacular to the layman, the red squirrel. This red squirrel. Hmm. Yes, squirrel. I've heard of them. Yes. So. So it's a simple malish. We need a squirrel, and we put him here. You know, spill your milk? We don't get duct tape. Gentlemen. Yes, my liege. Get me one of these red squirrels. Yes, my liege. Really? That's the only answer you can come up with? How you doing? Hi, hi, how you doing? Come on, come in now. Yeah, sit down, what do you want? Oh, this, this place really smells. Ah, uh, well, you wear like f***ing dung beetles and you roll the poo around, f*** knows what's for. Oh, really? If you want some, you want some poo, um, uh, uh, Alright, get your f***ing ass in there. There's these f***ing cows. Get them in there, get them to crap, and I'll make you a ball of poo. And you can do what the hell you like with it. Go on, on your bike. You still here? F*** that. Oh, Johnny. Well, this guy is really nice. Let's get back to the professor for a second. Seriously? Red squirrels under the table. That's the only answer you can come up with to fix the table. Not buying the table, fixing the like He's a professor for... Mm, sake. So, yeah. Well, as we stand here, it's not a B button. Well, we see a little ting, so let's press B. Turn into an anvil again and go down. Conquer quickly puts up his gas mask. Okay. There's some money crying, but we can't really do anything right now, so let's just continue up. Uh, so here we have a big pit. Uh, if you fall down, don't worry. You'll just get sent back. So let's grab the ropes and. Well, here you go, you get sent back. So, <laughs> just like a, an example, really. So, let's just swing on to the ropes. And if we go up and down, we can not really swing, but we can jump to another rope, so let's do that. Make our way up. We well, can see some bits of chocolate there. Let's see how far this road goes. Uh, that's pretty much it. So we can't really do anything. 
with that right now. So let's not fall down. I wanted to jump on the platform, come on. What? Okay. Let's do that again. Actually, got one. That's good. Let's see, we can see here where the poo is floating out is where we want to go. But how do we get there? Okay. Again, if this takes too long, I'm just gonna cut it right here. Right here. I'm gonna cut it if uh, this takes too long. I'm just gonna leave it running and if I get it in the first guy, well, then you'll see it. If I don't, then you'll just see a little cut and we'll move on to where we do find it. I should have done that the first time. Okay, so right now we're in a new area. Let's see if there's something here. Nope, there is not. So let's just go up here and see where we're heading. Ah, right, don't see any poo here. Oh, hey, uh, excuse me, hello. Yeah, you. Uh, <clears throat> whoa. <laughs> Friendly type. I'm looking for some poo. I know it sounds pretty strange, but... <coughs> oh. <coughs> red. Red. I don't like red. <coughs> I hate red. Go away. Whoa. Take it, he doesn't like red. What? I don't see anything red around. Oh. Here we go again. I'm actually kind of orange, not red, but, um, okay. Why is the camera acting all weird? Can the camera please stop acting weird? <laughs> there we go. Got the camera out of the, out of the cabin. Okay, so, this little bull right there doesn't like red. Now, we are, of course, a red squirrel. Oh, jeez. Uh... So that wouldn't work too well. Let's see what we can do about that. On the other hand, um, let me just tell you guys a little something. Actually, bulls are colorblind. They just use the red um, cloth to make it flashy, you know? So, uh, yeah. Bulls are colorblind. That's just uh, the way it is. Let's see. We're supposed to go to. Oop! Ouch. Don't hit me, man. I can't help it that I'm a red squirrel. Now quit. Let's just fly to this little piece of chocolate right here. And we can see a little thing called prune juice. Well, isn't that interesting? I also see some poo falling here. So it's probably important. Let's go behind and see where we end up. Uh, nowhere from here. Can we so close? That makes me. Don't harass me, bro. Let me just turn the camera around and see if I missed anything.
There's got to be something here. Come on, Conker. I see where we have to go. Run around here real quick. And we got some slopes here. Try to avoid the bolts of food. Actually, for now, I'm just trying to jump on here. Because there's this little annoying gap. And of course, it's 3D, and I have a problem with that, so. Ouch! Balls of poo hurts people, really. They actually hurt. So let's just hide in here. Oh. Hi. Jump. 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 We did it. Well, how both of who can fit through that hole, I don't know. At least we got some chocolate for our troubles. Let's see, this has to spin. So let's run and spin. Just follow the arrow. And we'll see some prune coming out. Yummy. And what does prune do? Something that drinks that. It's gonna get the screaming squit. Hmm. Ah, that looks distinctly like a target. And there we have a bow. Yes. I think I get it. I think so too. So let's just go down and kill ourselves apparently. Let's not do that anymore, shall we? Okay, so now you guys know. Don't jump off, you'll kill yourself. At least we have full health again. So let's go to the target and not get killed by the bull. There we go. Oh, little bull. We have to get him somewhere in the middle first. So let's do that and see if we can get him to hit this target right here. There we go. And he hit them, and of course he hit me as well. That's okay. At least we got him. Now that could be useful. Right. Yes. This looks like it needs a little bit more hands-on control. He's a bit of a wild one. Ooh, that time again, is it? Oh, I say bugger looks is out here again. Oh, well. Oh, that's a nice little patch. I think I'll have a little bit of dress. Moo. Very convincing. Need to get her over there somehow. Hmm. Looks like there's more targets. Run first. Grab a piece of chocolate. Let's see, where's the target? Right here, well, he's standing perfectly for it, isn't he? So let's just jump on top. Press B. And hit the cow. Stop you nonsense, young man. Goodness me. I've quite lost my appetite now. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go for a little meander over here. Hmm. Actually, I feel a bit thirsty. A nice little beverage should wash this tasty grass down lovely like. This looks quite nice. Looks to be cranberry flavoured. Lovely. It's Ooh. not cranberry. Mmm, <laughs> tastes a bit hot. Oh, I'll have some more. Mm. Mm. There we go. Oh. There we go. There she blows. So if you guys ate in the last hour, I suggest you turn it off, which is now a bit um, too late. Oh, that's... Ah. Oh, I'll just stay here for a while, just in case, you never know. Looks like he's just about ready to go. Looks like. So, 
we're still in this bowl here. Let's hit her and kill her. Apparently. We didn't know we could do that. So let's go for another cow. Come on, cow. Or wolf. Oops. You gonna hit the sign, buddy? He doesn't want to hit the sign. Ah, there we go. Let's sit on him. And... Charge up to the cow. Then the cow will go train her. Ah, she wouldn't. Of course she would. Oh. We missed. And we get curled down. So let's do that again. Here he comes. Olay. Charge the cow. Boom! And get her to poo. So I hope she does. Yep, there she goes. Now we get curled down again. See if we can find some chocolate bits, shall we? Maybe I. Oh no, there's one. And I can see one over here as well. Well, that girl's cooing. We can take control of the bull again. And I can kill in the process, hopefully. We can hit him. Okay. Yeah, he got his head stuck. So, let's go kill the bull. Let's press B, and hit her. And then she died. Get off. And I see a piece of chocolate over here, which I am happily going to eat. Chocolate open this one, yeah. And further along, one again. So here's our little sign, so let's stand behind here. And hopefully he'll hit the sign. We jump off. And then of course another cow comes up. And just make our way to this little thing over here again. Hopefully he'll hit us. Aw, he hit us through the fence. I didn't even know you could do that. Let's quickly jump on. And press B. So we can hit the cow. Just keep running around in circles and hopefully... Of course not. Okay. Press the B again. And hit the cow. Come on, girl. Dropped off again, but thankfully near a piece of chocolate, so let's take it. Go on ahead to this little platform over here. Oh, he didn't get his head stuck. Oops. Can't see. There. Ah, there we go. Let's jump on and hit the cow. Boom! There you go. Hopefully she'll go eat her prune juice now. See here? She will. Finally. 
eating the fern juice. He's just running around in circles, waiting for her to run like hell towards there. Letting her poo for a bit. Then press to B again. Let's kill her. Kill! I think we're just about done. I have no idea where you're at fast. Seems to be filled up with poo. That should do it. So yeah. There we go. We uh did it. Let's go grab some pieces of chocolate to heal us up. See, chocolate's good for everything. I need two pieces. So let's grab them. I just love how these bits of chocolate refresh uh, every like 10 seconds or so. Uh, seeing as uh, this is the only way out of here, so let's jump down. That's disgusting. But we're now back to uh, the place where we uh, jumped on the rope. You're covered in poop for a little conquer. Uh, so yeah. Let's jump up, see if we can... There's nothing here, except for our tail, so let's, uh, get out of here. Ew. I know, conquer, I'm sorry. Not much I can do about this one. Let's see, there is a B button here. Let's push it. Confidence pill. Hmm. Oh. Ah. Yeah. Hey. I feel a lot more confident. Yeah. Won't need these anymore. And if I'm a lot more confident, then I should be able to swim on the water now. Hmm. How would I do that? Let's see. Press B, and that should submerge me. Then, once I'm on the water, hold down B to make me swim. Find the control stick in the direction you want to go. That's it. Um, are you sure you got that? Yes, I did. And if I'm a lot more oh. confident, then I, I press B. Be Sorry, you guys. Now. I do that. Let's see. Let's just uh, skip this. And Sorry. Submerge me. Then, once I'm on the water, hold down B to make me swim. Point the control stick in the direction you want to go. That's it. Um, are you sure you've got that? Yes. Okay, so now we can swim in poo, which is really disgusting. So let's go back to the first area and... Well, guys, we're going down. Hey, what about me? Let's go see if we can't find something. Is anybody else getting nauseous from this? Let's find our opening. We're starting to lose health. And we found some money! So let's grab the cash. Yeah, more fun doing. Okay, so we're going to swim back. Hopefully not die in the process. And I went the wrong way, of course. Looks like Conquer is in a bit of a spill here, so let's go for air for just a second. And go down again, and swim 
all the way back to the beginning. I'm gonna swim back to the cabin. Not that way, it's fine. Fine, I'll take it for a second. Let's see, where are we? Oh, yeah, this was uh, the way towards. Exit. I wonder if we swim down here we can go back to the cabin. Yep! So here we are at the cabin. And looking at my timer I think we've just about reached our 30 minute verdict. As you can see, this guy's gone. I wonder where he went. Well at least we're clean now so let's leave Conquer to his business. Which he's going to do right now. He's going to play a video game, and I suggest you might do the same thing. And I am going to do something else than playing video games because I've had enough for today. So I'll see you guys next week. Bye!